And I don't really talk much in the Stay Alive field chat, but they have been extremely helpful with uh, advice about uh, keeping your character alive. They also look for groups for dungeons if you want to uh, join a dungeon. I see a lot of people wanting to do hogger quests, which is another benefit uh, in Turtle WoW, Alliance and Horde can group up with each other and complete quests and dungeons, so that's really helpful. They could also talk to each other, too. I see a lot of people in chat wanting to buy and trade things, especially when it comes to resources, or if you're doing the Stranglethorn quests, some people have various pages that they can trade or buy from you, which is extremely helpful. I chose to opt out on that quest because backspace is very, very uh, hard to come by for me. It seems like if you're an Alliance player, the majority of deaths are going to be in Westfall, so be careful with that area. Or the majority of deaths is Barrens, so that level 10 to 20 zone is pretty difficult. Same with 20 to 30. There are fewer deaths, but it does happen. Uh, especially if you're an alliance and you're questing in Duskwood. There are some people who would just AoE and get attacked by something called an Unseen. Which you can't see this thing at all and it's just going to KO you and die. So be very careful about AoEs or things like Battle Shout if you're a warrior. Uh, any spells like that. Be careful with aggroing an Unseen. Those things will just kill you. Professions are really going to help out with your chance of survival. Uh, for me, I've got alchemy, which uh, I have the ability to make various potions and stuff. Hello, Vola. How you doing? So definitely try to keep up with your professions is what I'm trying to do right now. Uh, with fishing... Uh, it's really helpful for a mana user. Oh, oily black moon. That's really useful for alchemy too. So I'm gonna go get that. But I've been fishing like this raw sage fish. It's gonna be really useful for mana and cooking once I get my cooking up to 80. Oh, it's at 79 right now. I'm really close to be able to cook these sage fish. Someone competing over there. For resources. Oh, they're trying to block me off too. There we go. Oh. This person. Oh, my fish got away. Yeah, my fishing skill is not very high. I think I took the last fish. I'm sorry, dude, but I need the resources too. I think it takes uh, two oil. Yep, I need two of them to make my black mouth oil, which is going to be really helpful. For my upcoming uh, quest to get the aquatic form. Yeah, sorry this video isn't that much action packed right now. I'm just sharing some of my personal tips of surviving hardcore. And for those of you, oh, another one, another one. Oh! I hope that jerk doesn't show up. Resources, especially with the surge of new players, is becoming a bit competitive right now. But anyway, like I said, sorry that this episode isn't so action-packed and I'm just here trying to catch up on my professions. But hopefully um, all these tips and stuff are just mostly based on my personal experience and what I've seen in guild chat. 
And uh, there's probably way many more ways to survive uh, this game. I, I got cooking also because uh, that uh, stamina buff, or with the sagefish, the mana buff, is going to be really useful and help with my survivability. And I know it's helped me out several times. So I hope that any of these tips are useful. And there's definitely uh, a lot more that I've probably missed or haven't learned yet. And we're all just on this journey as we go. So thank you very much for listening. And as the population of Turtle Wow grows, I'm just excited and happy to see it. But I hope, um, I hope we're all just nice to each other. And I hope we keep this a good community because that's, that's why a lot of people stay for the people or the friendly people. The amazing game experience. This poor guy is being bullied by a couple of Alliance people. Probably because they're flagged. He doesn't stand a chance, but still. Poor guy. Tony! Uh, this. That character. Or that person. Invited me to do some sort of quest. But. I did not have the quest chain for it. But she was super nice. So. Um, she wasn't very pushy. She was like. She asked me. If I had this one quest, I forgot what it was, that requires a quest chain, but unfortunately I didn't have it. And she didn't really push me. I asked her if she needed help, but she was like, if you're not up for it, you don't have to. I was willing to help her, but also, uh, I was kind of doing my own thing, too. But still, though, good player, super nice. Okay, this is scary. Random disconnect. I'm glad I wasn't in combat. But... Oh boy. This is really scary. I wonder if it has something to do with, uh... The population boost. Oh boy. Okay, moment of truth. Let's see if I'm alive and well. Okay, that's very interesting. Oh, people in guild chat. Woo, I'm alive. I'm alive too. Oh my god, server crash. Oh, everyone's alive. How scary. My poor heart. Yeah, give my heart too. Jeez. Holy hell, that was scary. Um, wow. Oh man, people. Sorry, that was me. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Pee your pants. I was in the middle of fight, oh holy. Okay, looks like that person lived though. Holy, I was scared I died. I just cast Moonfire on an enemy. I was underwater. Oh my goodness. Was anybody close to death? Ah, uh, few people. Okay, one person said I died, but they could have been joking. Is it safe? God. Return to our tents. Yeah, this is getting scary. If your server crash killed your character run, then I think you're eligible to have it restored by the G. How many dead? Uh, don't worry, guys. Our server side DC is mostly safe. Some people have problems with action bars being reset. Um, looks like it happened to me here because I removed these and they're back. Um, looks like people are complaining. Oh, we got some respawn there. Looks like people are complaining about the population right now. It's causing some problems with server cr crashes and things like that. Too scared to adventure now. Yeah, me too. I'm getting kind of, getting kind of antsy here.
Okay, that was a little bit scary. <laughs> I kept paying attention to the chat. Um, oh. I'm getting scared, 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 I'm getting scared. Oh, that was that was a heart pounder. Okay. I'm still feeling a bit startled and freaked out from the server crash and seems like these uh mobs are responding pretty quickly. Um but I think I'm going to uh, take a little break, edit some video clips, upload it to YouTube, and I guess I'll see you guys next time. Take care, have fun, and stay alive.